crackberry.com. Hey everybody, this is Kevin for crackberry.com, bringing you a quick BlackBerry 101 video of one of my favorite native BlackBerry applications, the Password Keeper. You can find it by default in the uh, Applications folder on your home screen, and Password Keeper it does exactly what you would think it should do. It is one centralized place to keep uh, account info and passwords for um, you know things your your brain might not remember so well these days. Uh, so what you do is you set a master password for it. I won't show you mine, obviously. Thanks for the patience. And once you log in, you basically have access to uh, to all the account info you put into it. Really handy because once you you can't really multitask with this or leave it open, it closes automatically. Uh, if you ever try to log in and put in the wrong password, it's not going to work. You can set the number of attempts before it blocks you out of there. Uh, so we'll leave that one for a second and kind of show you the um, first time you go to set up the password keeper. It's going to prompt you to, to choose a new, pa new password. Make sure you use something really good. You know, toss the alt key in a few times for good measure. Make it confusing. And then once you're set up, we'll uh, demonstrate on this one. Now I put a really simple password in here for illustrative purposes, but don't do as I say here. We have a blank password keeper. So that's good, but we need to put account info in it. Very simple, hit the menu key, new, and now you're in, you're in business here and you can add your account. So we'll go ahead and, uh, you know, make uh, some fake info. We'll do a Crackberry account. Username is test test. Uh, should we put a password on it? Sure, or let's put a really easy one, Kevin. No, it's not what you do. You uh, People, we need to get away from using simple passwords. Way too many people in this world do that, and people are smart. You want really hard to remember cryptic ones. And luckily, there's a built-in random password generator here, so you don't have to think about it. Just hit that, you'll get a nice hard password, which you don't have to remember because it's going to remember for you. You can put in the URL. If you can't remember what uh, the login is for the account you're doing and put in some notes. Save it, done. You can go ahead and add another account, da 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 da, done. And from now on, you know, when you need to use this account, you don't need to worry about it. You just go into your password keeper, log in, and the account info is going to be there. So you can start using nice, difficult passwords for all your key accounts save them in one place, make sure they're secure, uh, and you're good to go. You can set different options in the password keeper here, uh, you know, the random password settings, so you're getting numbers, characters, the length of characters you want, how many password attempts, you could shrink that down if you uh, want to be really mean uh, and safe. And uh, that's it, password keeper. It's built into your BlackBerry's operating system. Uh, I use it, it's up to you if you want to use it, but it's something I find extremely handy that uh, has been very beneficial for myself. So check it out, Password Keeper. That's it for this one. Thanks for listening. That was a lame tap. Let's do that again. BlackBerry.com. Yeah.